Resolutions at the final day of the UN Habitat Assembly focused on five core areas. These include access to affordable housing, urban climate action, urban crisis recovery, local finance, and the implementation of sustainable development goals. We are holding on to achieving the SDGs and the new urban agenda. Uh, governments, programs, and policies have fully embedded in them uh, action plans that will lead to the realization of this. And so we are fully committed to the platform. We congratulate ourselves for coming this far, so far. This resolution is bringing countries together to learn from each other and create a form of solidarity that will then incite investors also to put money there with the necessary guarantees that will allow governments to provide incentives in collaboration with the private sector to put to increase the supply of housing to bring the prices down and to make sure that this affordability gap is closed. A roadmap for supporting cities and towns and developing innovative solutions to pressing challenges like climate emergencies, pollution and limited access to services were adopted. Almost all countries are struggling to ensure their citizens have access to affordable and adequate housing. 1.6 billion people around the world continue to live in an inadequate shelter. There will also be efforts at supporting more climate-resilient cities and towns as well as innovative recovery strategies which will be in regions that experience high levels of climate-induced displacement such as Sub-Saharan Africa and South Asia. Affordable housing for all has been the main resolution in the just concluded UN Habitat Assembly and governments have been urged to increase the pace of urbanization that was slowed down by the COVID-19 pandemic and conflicts being witnessed across the globe. The World Habitat Day 2024 will be another theme engaging the youth to create a better future. For a long time, after so many years, youth have been given their space. They have been given their time to take charge. They have been given that time to be in the room because most of the time young people are included at the implementation stage. According to the UN Habitat officials, the resolutions passed will be instrumental to the growth of developing economies by opening our pathways for sustainable development. Nick Mudimba, CGTN, Nairobi, Kenya.